What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the living room. We are the October. So we're doing something different, man. We're checking out Game of Thrones, and I'm actually kind of nervous to do it because we are a movie channel. So we put out a poll on Patreon. This one, hands down. I've never seen it. Mrs. October's never seen it. So we're going to do it as long as it's getting support. So if you want to see us continue this series, just make sure you like the video. I'm really excited to watch it, man. So many people are really passionate about this show. Mrs. October, is there anything about the show that you want to say? Mm -mm, other than it came out in 2011 and it's an HBO show. Not really the biggest HBO fan because, you know, I don't think I've really heard of any of the shows on there. So I don't know, man. I don't really know what I'm about to get into, but this is Game of Thrones, people. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see what all this hype is about. I know, right? That just looks like Private Ryan. Yo, it does look like Private Ryan. He looks cold. <laughs> It's a really nice tunnel system, though. Oh, my. I'm getting chilly looking at that. Look at the contrast, though. Look at the wall. That's a wall, right? Or a big cave. Oh, like the Cliff of Dover or something. Okay, he took the other path. He's edgy. He kind of looks like the sloth off Ice Age. I didn't get a good look at him. What is that? That was body parts. <gasps> Whoa. Ooh. Whoa. The heads? What? Is a child? What? Yeah, I don't blame him. I'd be out too. All right, so we got some dead bodies. <gasps> oh, they're in a pattern. What? What do you expect? The savages. I've never seen wildlings do a thing like this. I've never seen a thing like this, not ever in my life. How close did you get? Close as any man would. We should head back to the wall. It was a wall. Our orders were to track the wildlings. They won't trouble us no more. You don't think he'll ask us how they died? Get back on your horse. <laughs> He's kind of sassy. You want to run away south? Run away. Of course, they will behead you as a deserter if I don't catch you first. Get back on your horse. I won't say it again. Why does he have to take orders from him? A deserter from what? This is the army? I don't know. He is like on a more like extravagant cloak with no hood on it. Oh, so he's more like high Maybe up Maybe he's like a rank. Yeah, a rank up. Well, they look like hobbits. A little bit taller. Your dead men seem to have moved camp. They were here. What? See where they went. That peace sign's not there anymore? Oh, that's the exact spot? So they say. Where the wild things are. Yeah. Oh, what did you pick up? What is it? Is that intestines? <gasps> I don't know, dude. It looks like some organs. <gasps> oh, slice. That's what he gets for wanting to investigate. They seen it. <laughs> that horse said it. <laughs> <She's> a... <laughs> is that no? <laughs> oh, he sees that. <gasps> that kid was just on a tree. Why does his eyes look like that? That was a girl. Her. Why does her eyes look like that? No, you can't stop. You better go. Is this a dream, though? <gasps> oh. oh. Who's oh. that? Oh, my God. He just tossed it to him. Right at his feet. So we... Can we know? Dude, every oh, time... here we go. Like, okay, when I think of this, I think of someone just playing the violin really hard. Like just straight going in. Bro, I kinda like this. I think oh, it, hey, I like it. I like it's cool. I think it's really cool how it's like mechanical stuff. That was cool. Whoa, that's like a sun. Oh, that's that wall. Oh, there's that wall right there. Look. Oh yeah, it says the wall. Oh, it's called the wall. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So this is like a map. Maybe I should have paid attention more. Yeah. That's on Instead me. of just noticing how like <laughs> that's on me. how cool it was, yeah, I wasn't paying attention. I like the sound, bro. I was getting Lord of the Ring vibes, right? <laughs> yeah. King's Landing. Oh, we better remember this stuff, I think. Someone told us to remember everything, like... Pentos. <laughs> <laughs> the beans. Right, that's what I was thinking. Maybe I said it wrong. <laughs> Ooh. This is based off a book. That thing was tickling my ear. Do you hear that? Yeah. It said... Ting, 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 ting. <laughs> ting, ling, ling. Oh, it's wartime. 
I'm not really getting Lord of the Rings vibes from it though. Not not really. It's a different vibe. Oh, they said that he'd be a deserter. And take his head off. Winter fell. I thought it'd be like snowy there. Because the winter fell? Yeah. <laughs> Good try, but. Go on. Father's watching. And your mother. <laughs> they really are. <laughs> is he in like competition right now or is he just Just practicing? Like shooting shooting some hoops, <laughs> you know. <laughs> You really don't like sewing. <laughs> Sail! <laughs> Which one of right. you was a marksman at 10? Keep practicing, Bran. Go on. Don't think too much, Bran. Dang. Oh. Oh, I thought he hit it. Dang, I thought Oh, he she hit, hit it. it. Oh! Is that his girlfriend? Lord Stark! Right, that little girl came over and made him Showed look bad. Showed him up. Captured a deserter from the Night's Watch. Get the lads to settle their horses. Do you have to? He swore an oath, Cat. Law is law, my lady. Oh, shoot. Tell Bran he's coming too. Ten is too young to see such things. He won't be a boy forever. He Ooh. wants him to see him cut his head off? Yeah. Whoa. Or something. I was so distracted by that guy's beard, I didn't know what he said. Well, they said in the woods that if you desert, you're going to get your head cut off, right? Oh, no. They're going to have to sacrifice him? I think so. He said, cut your head off or shoot you with arrows. One of them. Oh, that's the spot to put the head. <gasps> yeah. Oh. He's a deserter. What did he just deserted those people from killing him? Dude, this is HBO, so they might really show it too. Oh, no. I can't see this. Oh, my God. The 10 year old has to see this. No, I broke my oath. I don't know. I'm a deserter. I should have gone back to the war and won him, but I saw what I saw. I saw the White Walkers. People need to know. The what? Get word to my family. The White Walkers. Tell them I'm no coward. Tell them I'm sorry. He really saw him too, that poor guy. Dang. What was his oath? Not get stabbed up? No way. He's not gonna do this. Not in front of his son. In the name of Robert of the House Baratheon, first of his name. Don't look away. Father will know if you do. Lord of the Seven Kingdoms and Protector of the Realm. I, Eddard, the House Stark, Lord of Winterfell and Warden of the North, sentence you to die. Warden of the North. Oh. Oh my. So this show's graphic. This show's like that, huh? You did well. That poor baby. <clears throat> Let's go. Game of Thrones. Just starting the nuggets out young, I see. Do you understand why I had to kill him? Oh, where's the old way? <laughs> the man who passes the sentence should swing the sword. Is it Trace or the White Walkers? I like that. The man that passes the sentence should swing the sword. So he was like. The madman sees what he sees. So he's the executioner. Judge, jury, and executioner. <gasps> oh, the maggot. What is it? Oh, so many beheadings and now this. No, that's a wolverine. Yeah, but gross. Oh, Some my. wolves. Babies. It's a freak. It's a dire wolf. Well, we got us some lore, some dire wolves. Yeah, they look like they know what that means. Yeah. It's a full beast. It's an old beast. There are no dire wolves south of the wall. No, there are five. Aw. They don't belong mm. down here. That's a quick death. Oh, no, keep them. No, they're not. No! Put away your blade. Take orders from your father, not you. Please, father. Oh my God, why? There are five pups, one for each of the Stark children. The dire wolf is a sigil of your house. Whoa, really? Then you can't kill him. Why is that even a question? You'll train them yourselves, you'll feed them yourselves, and if they die, you'll bury them yourselves. Dang. And if that wolf kills you, you'll bury yourself too. Right. Does that thing look huge? <laughs> look at that. Are they about to domesticate these pups? I'm not a Stark, get them. So he's kind of salty about that. I don't know. He said, like, "Get on." Maybe he just wanted a wolf. Yeah, I would. Which is it? He has two. Oh, six little wolves. <gasps> Run to the litter. Oh my god, I love that, that one. Yours, no. It's albino. With the red eyes. Oh, I like it. That one gets to run. What the King's Landing? That place looks crazy. Whoa. That's so creepy. <laughs> 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 I thought he was awake. What's the lore on those? Is it supposed to like help you like pass through your soul or something? Cause like the eyes are the gateway into the soul or something. Well, there's Fabio. <laughs> As your brother, I feel it's my duty to warn you. You worry too much. And you never worry about anything. What if John Aaron told someone? But who would he tell? My husband. If he told the king, both our heads would be skewered in the city gates by now. Whatever John Aaron knew or didn't know, it died with him. So her husband's the king. You should be the hand of the king. That's a none I can do without. Our days are too long. Our lives are too short. <laughs> yeah, he said, forget all that honor. <laughs> I don't need that. So the hand of the king died. Right. And so 
uh, his sister. That was his sister. So she's with the king. So she's, she's the queen. The queen. Oh, okay. Right. And I'm picking up that there's there's so like I thought she's like the queen or the, maybe the queen of that. Place. So this like little yeah I'm not sure yet, but these are the Starks I think. And then I don't know what those other people were called that we just met, but they said it too. Yeah. Started with an L I think, but I don't remember the Lanier's I think. <laughs> The Lake Lanier's. <laughs> right Lanier's. there, there it is, Lake Lanier. <laughs> years and I still feel like an outsider when I come here. That's beautiful. You have five northern children. You're not an outsider. I wonder if the old gods agree. It's your gods with all the rules. I am so sorry, my love. Tell me. John Aaron is dead. A fever took him. Natural causes, bro. I know he was like a father to you. Your sister, the boy. They both have their health. Gods be good. So his, her sister was married to the guy that died? Is, he said your sister, the boy? The raven brought more news. This is about to be difficult to keep up with. I know. Best. Right for Winterfell. He's coming this far north. There's only one thing he's after. You can always say no, Ned. What are they after? Uh, you know. Why is your mother so dead set on us getting pretty for the king? It's for the queen, I bet. They hear the prince is a right royal prick. Think of all those southern girls he gets to stab with his right royal prick. <laughs> Go on, Tommy. Shear him good. He's never met a girl he likes better than his own hair. <laughs> oh, he's shaving him up. Aww. <laughs> all right, so who's that? That would be cool. That would be cool to see. Obviously, he's the guy who tells like everyone that they're there. Oh, he's the guard. He needs to get down. Man can climb, can he? I know. <laughs> No, 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 that's the guy's son. Oh, that's the little archer dude. Yeah. Okay, I see. And these are the wolves. Oh my God, they do grow fast. Brandon. They really do, they just found them. <laughs> How many times have I told you, no climbing? Oh, so the king's coming to the town. That's cool. Is it? I mean, look, they decorated and everything. I well, they seem stressed. You promise me, no more climbing. I promise. Good, because you're going to fall and break something. No, he's too good at climbing. He's not. Look at your feet. Before you lie, <laughs> run and find your father. Tell him the king is close. Aww. I swear nothing better happened to those pups. <laughs> Be so mad. Wait, how many kids did that dude have? <laughs> Too many. <laughs> like seven, I think. There were like six boys. Whoa. That's cool. That mask was crazy. The helmet. What is that? Sansa, where's your sister? Dang, they got like 12 kids. Because <laughs> I forgot there's daughters. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, that's their daughter. That's her. Go on. Move. They kind of have a cute little family. <laughs> Man, she's trying to climb the rings, ain't she? <laughs> he he's a weasel vibe to him. <laughs> <laughs> right, don't yeah. He looks like he would have, have something smart to say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hope no one gets mad at me for saying that. Jeez Louise. I know he's probably like the great hero of this story. Uh, probably. That's the king. <laughs> Him? <laughs> <laughs> He, look, he looks like the guy from Last of Us, Bill. Right, he does, don't he? He looks like he got, <laughs> he got, he has a like hoarding situation underground. I wonder if we're gonna get the, he's sitting there eating grape scene. Oh, know, please just, no, because <laughs> he has the step ladder. <laughs> <laughs> it's the dude from Lord of the Rings, the, uh, the dwarf. Oh yeah, Gimli. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Your grace, you've got fat. <laughs> <laughs> What? I thought he was going to be pissed at him for something. <laughs> he looked at him and said. <laughs> <laughs> That's Boromir, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I thought I'd have missed somebody's name. Guarding the north for you, your grace. Winterfell is yours. Where's the emo? Will you shut up? Who have we here? Must be Rob. Yeah, with two Bs. You saw that. <laughs> it's Robbie B. <laughs> <laughs> your name is? Oh, yeah. Shows your muscles. You'll be a soldier. What a great politician. <laughs> right. Jamie Lannister, the queen's twin brother. Would you please shut up? My queen. My queen. Take me to your crypt. I want to pay my respects. Dang, <laughs> you just <Yeah>. got there. <laughs> I don't really like the queen's vibe. Me either. She's that was weird. Like, where she, yeah, exactly. It's like she's got a whole fox tail on her back. Like, the imp. What is that imp? Probably like another dog of some sort. Go and find the little beast. Oh yeah, you're probably right. Tell me about John Aaron. One minute he was fine, and then burned right through him, whatever it was. I loved that man. And we both did. I need you, Ned, down at King's Landing, not up here where you're no damn use to anybody. Lord Eddard Stark, I would name you the Hand of the King. That's what he was. Dude, I'm dumb, obviously, right? The Hand of the King just died. Oh, that's why he yeah. they said they knew. Right. I'm not trying to honor you. I'm trying to get you to run my kingdom while I eat, drink, and haul my way to an early grave. <laughs> <laughs> 
You helped me win the Iron Throne, now help me keep the damn thing. <laughs> we were meant to rule together. If your sister had lived, we'd have been bound by blood. Well, it's not too late. I have a son, you have a daughter. We'll join our houses. He said help him win the, the Iron Throne. He won it? I'm assuming the Iron Throne is like, because he's the king, right? So they took it over? They won it. Maybe they're like tyrants. What the hell? It's the guy who conjured the weapon on Bro, that's the dude Thor. from Marvel. Yeah, the one who made the menorah, right? No, he made... What? <laughs> it is true what they say about the northern gals. <laughs> He's way different in this one. Yeah. I hear they call him the imp. I hear he hates that nickname. So he's a nymph. That's the queen's brother too? Oh, so, okay. Don't get up. My lord. <laughs> <laughs> Our sister craves your attention. Okay, yeah, that's her brother. Don't leave me alone with these people. I've begun the feast a bit early, and this is the first of many courses. <laughs> Since we're short on time, come on, girls. <laughs> I mean, I guess you can say that's a good brother. Yeah. Because <laughs> I guess that's what he likes. Right, sure. Did you have to bury her in a place like this? She belonged with me. Oh, that's why they know each other so good. In my dreams, I kill him every night. <laughs> Targaryens are gone. Not all of them. No, so, something's just up with the queen, I guess. She's just kind of like evil. To oh, me. so he like kind of married her because he had to for some reason. Who is this? I thought it was the queen when she's younger. There's our bride to be. A gift from Illyria. I like Pentos. It looks cool there. Isn't he a gracious host? He knows I won't forget my friends when I come into my throne. Everybody wants a throne. I guess so. Something tells me he ain't gonna get one. You have a woman's body now. Why is this guy just doing that to her? Yeah, she was dead in the face. She's here. Yeah, like it's it happens a lot. You don't want to wake the dragon, do you? No. This is where the dragons are, huh? I guess so. When they write the history of my reign, sweet sister, they will say it began today. That's her brother touching on her like that? Bruh, he had his thumb all up on her nipple, didn't he? <laughs> I don't condone that. And that bath looks like it's about to burn your leg off. This show's already had like two naked people and like seven beheadings. Right, this is not like Marvel. <laughs> I kind of like my bath that hot too. She does. She's like a dragon in there, bruh. <laughs> the Dothraki are not known for their punctuality. The Dothraki ride around on horses, don't they? Are you sure that's not the people that announce them? That's what they said, the Dothraki. May I present my honored guests, Viserys, third of his name, and his sister, Daenerys. You see, our honored Viserys, when Dothraki are defeated in combat, they cut off their braid so the whole world can see their shame. Oh, snap. Does he have fight battles? Like, what does that mean he's never been defeated? Right, right, yeah. It's cool how when you're from different kingdoms, how different you look, though. Everyone has a different vibe. Right. That's Aquaman, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Did he just deny her? Like, does he say? Did he deny he said, her? No, no, thanks. <laughs> did he, but he didn't say anything. Did he like her? If he didn't like her, we'd know. <laughs> what does that mean? He would like kill her. <laughs> I bet she's so nervous right now. The anticipation. Take back your father's throne. They cry out for their true king. So that guy like is on the quest to be the real king. I know how to play a man like Drogo. I don't want to be his queen. That's the first thing she's like said this whole time. Right. I want to go home. How do we go home? I don't know. We go home with an army, with Khal Drogo's army. Oh my god. That little guy seems a little scrawny for that much ambition though. But how can he say all that and then kiss her forehead? When would we be married? <laughs> Soon or do we have to wait? Hush now. Your father hasn't even said yes. What? The father? He'd be the second most powerful man in the kingdom. He'd have to leave home. He'd have to leave me. And so would you. You left your home to come here, and I'd be queen someday. Please. It's the only thing I ever wanted. Well, didn't he really not have a choice? Didn't he have to be the hand of the king? Well, was he allowed to say no? Him yes. and the king are really good friends, so I wouldn't imagine he'd like... Is that the king? Try to have him executed or something. Oh my god, that's the king? Yeah, he don't care. Oh my god. He's dead, yes. Oh, he was training. <laughs> Hitting the gym. While everyone's at a party. Didn't want to leave you alone with the Lannisters. Lady Stark thought it might insult the royal family to see the bastard in their midst. Well, you're always welcome on the wall. No bastard was ever refused to see that. So take me with you when you go back. Oh, so he's like a literal bastard. So he's like adopted. I guess. I better get inside. Rescue your father from his guests. I feel like his father's like respected because everyone so far seems like they like him. He's like he's a good leader, I guess. You're Tyrion Lannister, Queen's brother. My greatest accomplishment. <laughs> 
You, hmm. Ned Stark's bastard, aren't you? So what's that mean? He just, like, works for him? No, bastards mean, like, you don't have a dad. Well, yeah, I know that, but I'm saying, why is he hanging out with Ned? Lord Edit Stark is my father. Lady Stark is not your mother. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, okay. Never forget what you are. Wear it like armor. Never be used to hurt you. Wow. What the hell do you know about being a bastard? All dwarves are bastards in their father's eyes. Aw. Dang, so they kind of, kind of resonated with each other, I guess. Right, so I'm seeing some drama in this royal <laughs> family. Yeah, like, the mom clearly doesn't like him. Mm. The boy I beheaded, did you know him? Of course I did. Dang. He was talking madness. So the walkers slaughtered his friend. A wildling ambush. Dire wolves, south of the wall. Talk of the walkers. My brother might be the next hand to the king. Winter is coming. That's the title of the episode. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. I forgot about those little demon looking things and ice demons. Forgot all about those. Is this your first time in the north, Your Grace? Yes. Lovely country. Mm -hmm. She like, thinks they're a bunch of hillbillies, don't yeah. she? Yeah. <laughs> like, y'all wildin' out here. I remember how scared I was when Ned brought me up here for the first time. Hello, little dove. Little dove. How old are you? Thirteen, Your Grace. And have you bled yet? What? No, Your Grace. In your dress, did you make it? You must make something for me. Yeah, she bowed and walked off. <laughs> your daughter will do well in the capital. Such a beauty shouldn't stay hidden up here forever. Dang. Well, shots, no problem. He just took it? Yeah, you just gotta roll with those. She's the queen. <laughs> I hear we might be neighbors soon. Yes, the king has honored me with his offer. I'm sure we'll have a tournament to celebrate the new title. If you accept, competition has become a bit stale. I don't fight in tournaments. Just when I fight a man for real. I don't want him to know what I can know. This royal family is kind of like arrogant, ain't they? They're kind of sneaky, like, like they like seem like something's up with them. Right, like some dirty politicians or something. You know, the set's pretty amazing too. Yeah. I won't let him take you. He takes what he wants. I'll say, listen, fat man. <laughs> <laughs> he belongs to me now. Aww. Pardon, my lord, my lady, from your sister. They're probably urgent. What's she doing at the Eyrie? She hasn't been back there since her wedding. What's the Eyrie? <laughs> that sounds creepy. What news? Oh, wow. She says John Aaron was murdered by the Lannisters. She says the king is in danger. Liza's head would be on a spike right now if the wrong people had found that letter. Do you think she would risk her life if she wasn't certain her husband was murdered? The hand of the king was murdered? Right, that's what it seems like. Oh, wow. By the Lannisters, this, the queen's family. Who but you can protect the king? The king rode for a month to ask for Lord Stark's help. He's the only one he trusts. So he knows. He spent half his life fighting Robert's wars. He owes him nothing. Your father and brother rode south once on a king's demand. A different time, a different king. That was crazy. So, so he, we got some. Go he's like tight with that guy. He can't just tell him no. Right. Yeah. It seems like that's his boy for real. Like they've been through a lot. Well, it seems like he's done all the dirty work for him. Well, the king needs to get it together. Stop partying so much because. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The king might have had his day, but right now it's not it. I don't really understand. Why would they try to kill the king if she's the queen just by marrying him? Mm, I like, guess she can be in power. I don't know. Maybe she's got another man. Like, no, that's the. Is that a wedding present? Ugh. When do I meet with the Carl? We need to begin planning the invasion. Carl Drogo has promised you a crown. You shall have it. I've waited 17 years to get my phone back. So how old is he? Like 17? <laughs> so since he's been born? <laughs> <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> the Dorthraki crazy, ain't they? <laughs> what? I'd be so mad if that was, is that their wedding or like their engagement announcement? Bro, I don't know what they're doing, to be honest. I thought they were just having a cookout. <laughs> oh my They're God. just hanging out, right? He like likes that. He's like, thinks it's funny. <laughs> their own people? But why did that guy decide to fight though? For what? The Rocky wedding without at least three deaths is considered a dull affair. What? <laughs> and you want to send her off to this family? <laughs> yeah, gladly, he said. I'll fetch man. A uh, small gift for the new Khaleesi. Songs and histories from the Seven Kingdoms. Thank you, sir. Much better than them snakes. Sir Jorah Mormont of Bear Island. I served your father for many years. God be good, I hope to always serve the rightful king. So he's just a loyal dude, huh? Mm-mm, don't open it. Cool. Dragon's eggs, Daenerys. And the Shadowlands beyond a shine. That's a dragon egg? And a hatch? Oh, they said it's stone. Oh, they're not fertile. Thank you, Magister. This looks so cool, though. Like, they have scales as eggs. I can't believe she has to marry that guy. Like, what do y'all even talk about? Tell me again of your conquest. I don't even sp think they speak the same language. Oh, he got her a horse? That was dramatic. She better show that appreciation. She's beautiful. There you go. Right, what if she didn't have manners and she was, like, snobby? <laughs> There is no word for thank you in Dothraki. Oh, <laughs> kind of language is so negative. Make him happy. He's like, I'm going to do my best, but those customs, man. I don't know if I can compete with that. 
What do you think that her expectations are to stand there and stare at the sunset? <laughs> She's like, <laughs> they can't even talk to each other. They don't. They don't even know each other's language. No, nah, he said, like, I know that love language. Come here. <laughs> oh, she's like definitely not feeling this. Yeah, she just totally got auctioned off, bro. She's a pawn. Her own brother's pawning her off. It's not the only word that you know. <laughs> Is he for real? <laughs> Rough night, him. Whoa, look at the dude's head. He was good with a sphere as he used to be. No, but I'm still better than you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for saying yes. Oh, wow, he said yes. I ask you because I need you. You're a loyal friend. The last one I've got. I hope I'll serve you well. And I'll make sure you don't look so fucking grim all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, the king comes and just takes your whole dad away. That sucks. Maybe they get to go. Did it say yet? Aw. Nah, he don't want to go. Well, they like run this kingdom, right? Or whatever it is, is a kingdom? Yeah, Winterland. Yeah, they run it. Like, they're, oh, here he goes. He His just mama lied. told him not to climb. The dog's like, I, she done told you. He's so high up, too. Oh, my gosh. I know. It's like, come down here. Oh, yeah. You wildin'. Oh, it's the dude's brother. Why is he just up in a castle doing this? Right. <gasps> that's the that's queen. That's his sister. Oh, my God. That's the queen. Ew. Stop. Stop. Oh. Uh. Are you completely mad? What? He saw us. I heard you the first time. What are they going to do? Quite the little climb, aren't you? How old are you, boy? Ten. The things I do for love. <laughs> They just killed that little boy? They just murdered that little dude. That was the dude's... Bro. That was nuts. That was gross. This is crazy. What? That was Ugh. the the king of the North Sun, who's now the hand of the king. Hold on. What's going on here? What the heck are we supposed to do with that information? Yo, that was gross, bro. So the dude's... There's like two signs of... a of uh, What is it called when you like your siblings? Oh, like, um, incest? Oh. And yeah, there's two signs of incest on that already. And it's episode one. Yeah, that was a heavy episode. <laughs> um, definitely not what we normally try to do over here. But you know what? I'll be honest, it was captivating. I guess it was wild. Uh, there's a lot of twists, dude. Like, crazy. Episode one. Yeah, that was episode one. It seems like, so it started out, they were at this giant ice wall. And I don't really remember where it was, but they said the region of where it was. But they was out there and they were looking for these some wild people things. some wild things right they're yeah. looking for the wild things and they apparently found some monster action going on some frozen demon monster action and the guy ran from it and told the story of it he wasn't believed and well no he apparently have some had some type of oath and he said he betrayed his oath i don't know what that's about um, I don't know. He betrayed his oath, so they had to cut his head off because he betrayed the oath. Yeah, I don't know what what his oath is. But. but ultimately, he said, hey, man, I saw some some frozen demonic action going on. And they said, man, I don't believe you. And he said, I'm for real. I'm, you know, I'm I'm, I'm just telling you the truth. They cut his head off anyways. Um, they got some wolves. Um, basically, man, what I'm seeing is there's just some different, I guess, houses, you could say. And they have different names based on like the geography of where they are. And, and then, like, I think it's their, like, family name, too. So I guess the king came because the hand of the king died so you know but he was murdered we found out he was murdered. right and so they thought he was just d dead from like a common cold or something like that or a virus or something oh like natural causes yeah. right and then it turns out he was murdered but they think he was murdered by the lannisters which is the queen's family right so that was the show's way of like shaking things up right bringing the king there disrupting the harmony that was going on wherever that place was i think it was winterville wherever they were yeah so they came disrupted all of that and then to top it all off, that little boy was coming like his mama told him not to do. Saw some gross incest action going on. Right. And ultimately, that dude pushed him out the window. He right. has no regard. So. Oh, and the imp is also related to the queen. Yeah. And he's, he's and then the, that guy he was talking to outside was related to the king of the north guy. You know which one I'm talking about? I the do. one outside? Yeah. The one that's a bastard. Right. The dude with the... Long black hair. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and they were Loki kind of like being mean to him the whole episode. Like, you know, Loki making stabs at him. And he was like, trying to run off to go dog. join that whatever. He was trying to run off to go join something, man. But the guy was telling him, you don't want to do it. And I guess because he's just. I guess he's just trying to escape whatever he has going on there because right, he keeps he's picking on him. Right. And yeah. in society, especially in older times, like, you know. And I could see why the mom might not like him because, like, I'm assuming either he had him at a wedlock or something she probably just has a scorn which you know makes him feel guilty around the child so that's a whole different thing man that's tough uh yeah, yeah and then another thing so the guys aquaman the guy who plays aquaman mm -hmm. they got something going on apparently he's really the rightful heir or something and no 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 to... the really blonde guy i don't know his name guys yet 
the really blonde guy, he's trying to get back a throne. That's what I'm saying. Apparently, he's I don't know if it's the main throne or like his throne for because they don't even have somewhere to live. Apparently. Well, he said that he was going to sail across the sea and take back his throne. Right. And so the guy was filling his head with, you know, they secretly await the day that you know of your return basically they they want your return and he's basically feeling his head like hey they really want you to do that he said he's willing to like just do really gross things to his own sister for it so yeah a lot of incest going on in this show a lot i'm not of really sure where like the blondes are gonna like go into the story of like the king and all that right but i i think that's cool that it's on like two different regions i guess yeah so i mean i guess really like my first impressions you know it's pretty intriguing you know definitely excited to see more of it it was really really interesting to see just the portrayal of like these kingdoms and stuff i'm yeah. sitting there watching it and i'm feeling like you know beautifully shot you know how in America, like everything's a box store. Everything is just mm -hmm. like a low rise ceiling, a fluorescent yeah. light, a plastic chair. You know what I'm saying? It just feels very corporate and like cheap short term. This show has a way of every, you know, like the main place where the king was from. The it king's looked landing. amazing. The king's right? landing. Yeah, that was beautiful. It almost makes you nostalgic to wonder like what it would have been like to grow up in a time like that when people really put yeah. a lot of time and passion into like architecture and stuff. Yeah, that would have been cool. My first impressions is it seems like it's going to be a lot to keep up with. So like Absolutely. if we were wrong in a lot of that stuff, guys, like we, I'm pretty sure we're gonna be wrong for a little bit right. but i think also like part of watching it i think we're gonna be wrong the learning of the geography we're gonna have right. to work on but i really think this is cool i really like the way it's shot and honestly like never would i think i would be into like any type of like what is this called medieval is this a medieval it's like some medieval fantasy or right something. so it's like a fantasy type thing i never thought right. i would like be interested to see like what what is ned ned mm -hmm. what is ned about to do being hand to the king i just need to know yeah i'm definitely interested to see uh definitely a lot of politics are about to come into play and that's why this seems a little intriguing to me not even gonna lie uh didn't really see any like battles or fights or no, anything not too many it was fights. Just but it seems like they're ready for one because that guy was right. like training during the during the dinner yeah we're he gonna was get like some battle. <laughs> even like the intro to the show was really cool i really like the music but I did notice like halfway through it, it was showing me the geography. So next episode, I'll definitely pay attention to that. Hopefully that'll help me get a better understanding of like where everything is and what's really going on in this world. So yeah, man, this is a lot of fun. This is probably gonna be a really long journey. Uh, it will be a long journey as long as it gets the support, you know? It does take a lot of time to edit these videos. So if you guys wanna see us continue this on YouTube, like we said in the beginning, man, just like, subscribe, definitely like the videos, share them if you're feeling, you know, really cool like that and just help support the content the best you can and we'll just keep putting them out. Thank you guys so much for watching. You got anything you wanna say? Nope. See you guys on the next one. Peace.